Hey Capricorns, welcome to your general read for the second half of April. This is a general and will not resonate with everybody, unfortunately. But I do do personal readings and my email will be in the description box as always. I'm sorry, we have the lovely sun shining through the window. So I'm hoping that you can see as this is the only time I have to do these readings so but i do already have some other generals out for april so not to worry so let's see here we <laughs> oh my god capricorn you could have told me the first card what is it king of cups obviously these are new cards as well so and the ace of wands so an offer coming in from this uh, water sign, you or this water sign cannot get each other or both out of your head here. You know, um, I feel like you've gone through enlightenment as well here. This offer, it almost looks like it could be the devil card. It's actually the ace of wands, um, you know, with these horns on her head. So it could be the Capricorn if you're cross watching that comes with the offer. If you're a Capricorn watching, it's probably the water sign coming in with an offer, but let's see. Um, doesn't have to be a water sign, but I'm always picking up really strongly that this water sign can't let go of this Capricorn. It's just like they're attached regardless. The death. <laughs> Scorpio, oh geez. Let's see the other card. Temperance, so fire sign for some, fire sign for some, but here we see you going through this major transformation and this higher learning. Look at this death card, it's like you know, coming out the other side of the tunnel. It's like definitely, um, I'm sensing some enlightenment going on. Look at that, um, on top of her head here. I feel like this person now wants to come forward and make an offer or you definitely want to make an offer here. Having gone through a transformation, changes in your life here, you may now want to be more transparent with this person or this person with you. Um, be more fair. Due to this transformation that they've gone through, they've changed here. But if you look at this temperance card she's all water right but for some yeah sagittarius um but it's always so heavy water in capricorn somebody actually asked me to continue with the capricorn scorpio reading so maybe you're getting your wish here this is somebody who after an ending went through a huge transformation got enlightenment waited for this person to change or come forward here and that's what i see happening now i see this person um coming forward with an offer whether you accept it or not is completely up to you too many there but um we have one and that's the ace of cups here try and keep it out the light Sorry, the Eight of Cups, not the Ace of Cups. Why have I got the Ace of Cups? Is that what they're going to offer? Yeah, so this is definitely after somebody walked away. But um, after walking away, they're now looking back here, as you can see. So yeah, this is definitely somebody who's walked away. If this is somebody new coming towards you, I would still think that they would be a water sign. Um, and I feel like they would be on a spiritual path, a spiritual journey here. Um, they like learning and things like that. So you could meet them like in education or something like that. Um, but yeah, this person has um, gained a lot of knowledge since um, their breakup from you or from another person. They've completely changed who they was so yeah that's what I see now this person um, 
turning around after walking away. It's like they've changed. Maybe their perspective changed, their point of view changed, or your point of view changed here somehow. <laughs> Ace of Pentacles. So that's beautiful. You know, not only do they want to communicate and want to make an offer towards you with the Ace of Wands, but they want to offer something very um, stable. They want this new beginning, a fresh, abundant new beginning here. It's like they're throwing their self at your mercy here. It's like they almost have to come back and, um, you know, offer something big now. It's like making an offering here, but a very solid offering after walking away. Could be you Capricorns or if you're cross watching for a Capricorn making an offer here, you know, or, you know, after they get in communication with you, you make a counter offer about, you know, let's do this right. Let's, you know, take our time and build this up solid this time. They just, they may come forward with an offer and want to rush and you say, you know, I'm happy to accept this offer, but let's take it slow. Could be something like that as it's a general here. Speaking of um, communication and somebody wanting to talk. Somebody um, needing to talk to you now, wanting to talk to you. They want to tell you they've changed. They want to tell you they've learned. Five of Cups. They're missing you terribly here. That's why they want to communicate. They are missing you so much with this Five of Cups. I feel like, you know, you could be all cried out here with this Five of Cups. But, you know, they are still missing you it is the best word. Ace of Swords, what did I say? They really, really want to talk to you. They want to clear things up. They want to tell you the truth. They want to really clear the air here. They want to tell you, they want to speak their truth. And their truth is, you know, um, after some soul searching and changes, they want to be with you now. So this is 100% communication coming in. And it'll be communication about wanting to move forward with you. Um, if you are not feeling like you want it to go slow, that would be Spirit's advice to you to, you know, not take it so fast. Six of Cups now. Like I said, somebody returning. They can't get you off their mind. They really, really are reminiscing about you constantly. Like I said, the message will be for the Watcher. So even if you're watching for the Capricorn, um... <laughs> The Capricorn will be thinking and feeling this towards you. And if you are going to say, you know, I'm not feeling this or then the message isn't for you. It just really is that simple. It's not for everybody. This is for somebody who has a history here with this person very strongly. And if there's no history, this is a water sign coming towards you. And the advice would be take things slowly here. So let's get one more card for Capricorn and let's see. Okay, two more cards, sorry. Queen of Wands and Seven of Wands. So yeah, we did mention a fire sign. Um... But I feel like this is just the action that's going to be taken. They're ready now to come forward. I feel like they will be very persistent as well with the Seven of Wands here. These two cards together, when I ask for one more, it's speaking of persistence and um, not stopping until they get what they want. The Queen of Wands can be um, quite a temptress here. You know, very seductive and coming forward um now definitely standing their ground and saying i'm gonna fight for you here whatever it takes i'm ready to take that action now 
So wow, Capricorn, someone's coming to get you, like it or not. Probably that water sign. Good luck, guys.